Now, the lack of needed equipment is impeding healthcare delivery at the Seventh Day Adventist Hospital at Riamwasi in the Setra South District of the Ashanti region. Authorities say expansion projects initiated at the hospital have come to a standstill due to funding constraints. The situation has resulted in congestion and increased referral of cases and the least pressure on personnel and facilities. Nanasa Sumensa reports. Mother and baby unit project has stalled for over 10 years amid congestion at the existing section. Gladys Frimpon is midwife in charge. Currently we have a problem which is affecting child and maternal health. We have four delivery beds which is not enough for the facility, which is not helping us to be able to help a lot of mothers in this vicinity. So sometimes we admit people on the floor. You know, we, we, our aim is to save everybody. But sometimes we admit and the place is not too big to accommodate all of them. Sometimes we have to refer cases to Asamai and Konfanoche. Hospital Administrator Stephen Hammond explains case referrals have increased as a result. Um, we have uh, averagely 14, uh, 69, 69 patients coming in and sometimes the world becomes very full to the extent that we even uh, lay down mattresses on the floor for patients. So because of this kind of challenges, management thought it wise for us to build this new block for the people of Yamwase. But due to um, financial constraints, we've gotten to the uh, lantern level and we need philanthropics to come and aid us complete this new project for us. Medical superintendent Dr. Michael Addo emphasizes the need to reduce the rate of referrals. We are trying our best to do what we can so that the pressure on the referral facilities will go down. Um, I have accepted posting here to help in the care of patients here. Currently we have even a surgeon in training who will be completing his studies. If he comes and both of us are here working, maybe the cases that will be sending out to CAT and other facilities will be reduced. But the current challenges that we are facing is um, mostly um, the facility lacks a lot of equipment and space to even work. Reporting for Joy News, Nana Asensu